How are you doing guys and welcome back to Mutant Year Zero. Last time we was up here on the Ark, we found out we got some shops, this elder guy just spoke to us, um, Prip was the the place where we take like the stuff like the boom box, um, and then Delta's fix pit was where we used the salvage we get for building weapons so we got a, a point added to revive a, a teammate for an additional two turns with the artifact we found last match which was a boom box which supposedly goes boom um because they think it's a bomb so what's this now investigate hammond's cabin so this is our current objective um just north of arc uh, on a steep cliff lies the outpost of hammond the stalker it is simple wooden cabin that does not offer the occasional visitor much this is where hammond spends most of his time always on the lookout for the unexpected so this is the location we need to head to uh yes okay so the the Ark's more of a uh, a point where we can just go and level up and buy new equipment. Maybe even get any side missions. It's our essential hub. And we're instantly in. Oh, Ant. What's he called? The pig has got to level up. Foreman. That's his name, isn't it? His health's plus one. That's because we put a mutation onto him. Um... Where do I go to? Oh. Here. Oh, so can I buy this then? Oh, it costs two. Oh, two points are available. Nice. So I'm thinking we get this now. Enables an action after sprinting. After using your second action point, your your body can trigger a burst of reserve stamina, which allows you to perform an action afterwards. Useful for reaching enemies who are far away from the crew. Note, this must be activated before you spent... Both action points. So it's basically a lot like um, run and gun. So we can activate this ability. He can then use all of his turns to get to a certain location. For example, a rush action. And then he can still fire. So we can put, put him up to somebody's face. Did I activate it? I didn't. God damn it. Um, and... He could go for the ins like kill with his shotgun right to somebody's face. Also, Dux has got a um, a new little visor, hasn't he? Which is this thing we picked up. <laughs> Military grade tactical vibes are used in the poker style conflict. This style piece of gear reduces glare, granting its wear wear a range bonus. He gets an extra 25% added to his weapon range. She's not so bad. Thanks for signing me up back there, you crazy pig. Yes, Mr. Elder. Sign us up for a suicide mission, Mr. Elder. Did you forget there's like a kajillion ghouls out here who want to kill us? Nobody gets to kill you but me now. Shut the duck up and keep moving. I'm telling you, Borman. Ain't no happy ending in this story. Stalkers don't get happy endings. We get each other. So watch my back. What are you doing over there? Shut the shut the duck up. I love that. I love the um, the comedy. Um, these two definitely bounce off each other. Still reminds me of Timon and Pumba though. Oh, what is that? Wow! Whoa! Check this thing out. It must have crashed. Look at this symbol on the side. It's like a star. How would you pronounce that? Mime, 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 mime cooperation or something. It's like uh, robotics, maybe advanced robotics. Maybe it's something we need to keep an eye out. Because if you saw the trailer, there was a little robots that was flying around. I wonder if that's the same company. Oh. Good news is we reached Heaven's cabin. Bad news is there's two friggin' ghouls casing the joint. A level four. Everything, but there are no secrets. Where are the secrets? 
ones in the north will catch Hammond and squeeze the secrets from his head. Hammond will tell right. us what the junk is for. The junk is for us. All of it. Oh, this guy's moving. This guy. Pay Pumper. Okay. So either we try to do this stealthily or we try to take a little fight here. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Maybe I try to take this guy stealthily, this Marauder. We could actually do it. He's only got four health, and I know the crossbow can actually kill, kill him. You have not been spotted. And yes, I do apologize. I saw in the last episode that I was thinking I was being spotted where I wasn't. Another one bites the ducks. <laughs> right, so we're back in. We've still got two marauders, and we know these are going to take. We're going to go up against a fight with these because I can't take them out in one. Um, you got a level up, which is nice. Increase your stamina, apparently giving you an additional plus two of movement range. I like how it's very easy on the eye and very simple to use, uh, this user interface they provided with this game. I think it's great. Right, so... Are they going to see me if I walk in here? I think we're going to... Whoa, that guy's a level... Is a hunter? Look at his level. He's got 10 health. Okay, this is going to be a fight scene. What I'm going to do... Is I'm gonna go into ambush here. Follow me. Let's bring Pumber over here so we don't have to waste so many turns to get it here. And what I want is I want to um ambush here so he gets behind this cover. So we're do we're gonna do a bit of science here real quick. No, I can't. You know what I can? I'm gonna hide him here so he's behind the cover. And then I'm gonna walk into this circle here. This is just for science. Okay. Where's my backup? I, I, I did get caught. I, I think it might be. I, I was thinking more. It should be a more line of sight sort of things. What the hell? Oh, okay. Overwatch. Right. Donut. He's on Overwatch as well. I want to activate you. I'd rather not go up against the half cover, you know. Their turn. Overwatch. Right, and Overwatch, these are gonna move in. Come filthy, filthy Come here! As good as dead! Take it! He missed. Okay, we need to be careful here with uh with Borman. He needs to get a heal. And they're gonna they're gonna be flanking us here in a second, so I'm gonna bring ducks back a step, and I want him to go onto Overwatch. Overwatch. And then I need to bring you. Um. I 
I need to get him healed. Okay, let's bring him behind the half cover. And then put a med kit on him. Okay, so it's a bit... Is that splash damage? Then I've got two left. Overwatch. Oh, no, he missed. Okay, so the Marauders... Right, you need to... Uh, Fight upon this guy. The Marauders, uh, these are melee, so they have to come to our face. What's that? Skull Splitter. Uh, guarantees the shooting unit to do critical damage, but lowers the chance of hits. Chance to hit is 0%. Chance to hit is 25%. I'm going to go on to Overwatch, Overwatch. here. Overwatch. He's trying to flank around. Wow, that was mean, Marauder. He's coming around the side as well. He's going on to Overwatch. They're probably going to get seen. Hmm. Our first little bit of a challenge, guys. him here now and then we're going to put you on overwatch in case they try to move he did he's going to try to come around the corner you going to come inside nope you're just following your little uh, guy over there right Borman is very close range, and with them being together, and him having 10 health, uh, I can't just like run up to him and shotgun him in the face because he's going to be widely exposed. The Shaman, we've got to play this very, very slowly. Overwatch. Um, he's got no chance to help that guy. I'm going to put these on Overwatch, Overwatch as well. I'm going to let them make the mistake here. Just like that. Yeah. Overwatch. Get that annoying freak! No sweat! Overwatch. I don't have any consumables, uh, meaning grenades. Um, he's now on Overwatch with the buff on Overwatch again. Um, but he does need to reload. And then I'm going to go on Overwatch. Overwatch. This could be just an Overwatch battle here. Um, so I need to reload. Um, so then I'm gonna head. Oh. Hmm. I'm just going to put him back on Overwatch again. Watch. Oh, I need you to hit. Oh, he's... Okay, so that's what that guy's speciality kind of thing is. It's a very much a call in the reinforcements. Chance to hit on that guy. Overwatch. I'm gonna go on Overwatch again. 
I think we're in a decent position right now. And we're doing damage to him, you know. We're just playing very defensive. Smash the feather one! As good as dead! Overwatch. Come here, filthy, filthy mutant! Come here! So he's... I'm being flanked right now by this guy. <laughs> just an Overwatch battle. No, he's going on Overwatch now. Overwatch. And what I believe as well is because we're playing on um, like medium difficulty, we're not going to get healed after a battle. We get healed 50%, I believe, and not fully. Try and get um, Mr. Ducks over here and a flank. Oh, oh my God! Take the swine! No sweat on Overwatch. Right, we can take this guy now. We'll bring him up right up to the edge of the wall. Oh no, he's on. Oops. And then I want you to fire on this guy. So no reinforcements gonna come in now at least. About to switch weapon here. Stay he does have two shotguns nice. at least. I need to give him a secondary weapon. Um, that is regroup. That won't be um something for short range. You can hit at least a little bit of range. I want want him a weapon basically with a bit of range. Um, far looker, uh, this tube-like object gives its user the ability to view distant objects up close. Might also come in handy as a weapon if you get in a tight spot. Okay. This is Hammond's far looker. Let's bring it back to prep before the ghouls take it. That name is all wrong. It should be a smaller fire, because when I looked into it, everything became smaller and more distant. Amazing what the ancients could make. What is that? One additional crit chance damage, 20% chance to disable robotic enemies. It's a damage module, Enclave Power Brick, which when equipped will give you a chance of the weapon emitting electrical projectiles. These can be used to do additional damage to mechanical enemies. Hmm. Additional medkit. That, 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 that's pretty decent. We needed more medkits. Pick up a pile of notes. Zone ghouls stripped this cabin clean. Almost everything useful was gone. But it's a good thing ghouls can't read. They ignored the diary hidden inside Hammond's desk. Me and Doug aren't big readers either. But we look for answers in the diary. And all we get is more questions. Hammond writes how he found the crash machine near his cabin. He's convinced the machine was sent as a message from a mythical place beyond the zone called Eden. Where everybody's happy and safe. 
When Hammond sees another machine fall north of here, he takes his stalker crew up there to find it. I close the diary. Here's the problem. Eden's a fairy tale. Some bedtime story mutants believe in, so they can get to sleep at night. So either Hammond is onto something, or his brain's got the rot, and he's about to kill a bunch of good stalkers. Guess we gotta find out. Me and Ducks have to go north. Farther from home than we've ever been. It's dangerous. Ducks thinks I'm crazy to press on. I don't disagree with him. Okay. I don't Interesting. care about some stupid Eden. But we need to find Hammond. And if he's going north, we're going north. If he's going north, that makes him a grade A certified loony. No one goes up there, Borman. And what's with... Zone Dog Camp. Uh, as the seasons pass, I'm forced further out into the zone to find out the most basic of objects. From time to time, I stumble across the odd hidden place, even in locations I imagine were already cleaned out by the stalkers seasons ago. One such place is to be found due west of the fallen machine. There appears to be the remains of an ancient camp, complete with transportable, uh, uh, complete with uh, with transportable hut. The location is currently home to a pack of zone dogs who, for some reason, tolerate my presence near to their breeding grounds. They pick off wandering ghouls, and I leave them alone. This un uh, unusual symbiosis, uh, symbiosis. Did I say that right? Works uh, for me quite well. They're following orders, just hmm. like us. The Ark can't run without Hammond, so we're bringing him back. Especially with ghoul packs coming this far south. Wonder what they're planning. The ghouls are too dumb to plan. Someone's pushing them down here. I feel it in my feathers. Well, we've, this is the crash site, right? We've already... F oh, I'm stuck. Unless there's another one. I'm trying to just grab as much stuff as I can, you know. We're traveling to question mark. Somewhat bombs block an enemy's line of sight, but will also block yours. Okay. Which is what we accidentally used on that enemy in the last episode. Oh, man, we've never been this far from the Ark before. Talk about undiscovered country, huh? You think we finally left the ghouls behind? Yeah, me neither. Okay, see, so we can't traverse across water. My brain must be rotting. Is that a beautiful woman I see before me? Wait, I know that beautiful woman. She's a stalker. Hello? Stay right there. Who are you? You're Selma, right? You're a mutant like us, on Hammond's team. Do I owe you money? No. Did I kill your brother? No. And Selma I am. Who are you? I'm Ducks, and he's Borman. Hello? Like the only walking duck and boar in the whole arc? Come on. That's funny. I think you've mistaken me for someone who gives a duck. I've got to catch up to Hammond before it's too late. You're part of Hammond's crew. How did you get separated? It was weird. We were all hearing strange voices, not from the zone, in our heads. And that's when the ghouls ambushed us. After the fight, I was somehow blinded, paralyzed. I could barely move. I told Hammond I'd catch up to him when it wore off. Two long, rough days. But I'm better now. He headed up north to a crash site to find some metal ship. Says it was sent from... Eden, I know. Do you believe him? If Hammond thinks there's an Eden, there's an Eden. Believe me. You guys are trying to find him too? And we can work together. This is insane. You want to go more north? Into Ghoul Central? They'll kill us. A lot of ghouls have tried to kill me, but I'm still here. So, am I part of your team or what? Okay, so we just got a new member. Um, let's see her abilities. Ancient pistol. She's only got a silent pistol. She has a Molotov. 
Uh, I believe this is the girl that was in the trailer. Um, I, was, I just remember this thing here. What are uh, this horn out of head? I'm just wondering if um, all of these, like Borman and ducks, used to be human and something's happened and they've mutated. I don't know much about it, but I believe it's a um, uh, a board game. So you got seven points available. Uh, draw enemy attention to yourself for one turn. You have always known how to really annoy anything living or sort of living. This time you bring this skill into the battlefield. You are now able to gather all nearby enemy attention to you in order to draw their attacks away from your crewmates. Or super tendons. Um, reach high places by simply moving or sprinting in combat. Your leg tendons are more uh, are become mutated, making them thicker and stronger. Uh, you are now able to move or sprint to high places freely and without the use of a ladder. That could be useful. Let's yeah, let's get that. I feel like we'll get oh. Using it at a, a higher elevation will definitely come in uh, clutch, maybe, to get that uh, additional uh, crit chances and flanking options. Area effect disables enemies' movement for one turn. Uh, records say that some ancient ancients would talk to their pet plants. Uh, the plants uh, then would react to the sound of their master's voice. Somehow you're now able to do the same except with trees which can be commanded to bind enemies with the with their twisted roots. Hmm, it's some it's, it is a key thing she needs to learn. So and then it's just obviously we get the choice of choosing one of these. I think I might give her a bit of a health boost. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Just because I'm playing Iron Man and I'm trying to keep everybody alive for as long as possible. Is there a way I can heal um, Borman now? I don't think there is. I think I've got to use it in uh, within combat. Well, anyway, we p picked up an additional uh, teammate. She has got a silenced pistol. Oh, I see them up there. Oh, wonder what that was. What's along here? Oh well, well, look what we have here. My great A stalker, or what? You see this hidden path through the forest? I see it, and it's got me a little bit worried. What the hell is that? Is that a wolf over there or something? Wow. You can have one hell of a flea market with this oh. junk. Look at these weird machines. A zone dog. They have got some health. Nice, we had a little bit of a crit damage on it. Gotcha. They are gonna be melee units, I presume. Sleep it off. Got that right here. No. Nice. He's been seen he's seen us over there. Whoa. Easy tiger. What you got. Nice. Oh. 
damn. I'm gonna put him on Overwatch. Overwatch. Just in case the dog tries to come down and uh, attack Borman, which he's doing. And he missed. Oh god. When a stalker takes too much damage, they will bleed out. Move claws uh, and use a med kit to save them uh, with the indicate. Dies in five turns. Oh god. Bye bye. That's a wrap. Is it because I had his pistol equipped? Oh. Oh, he's back up. Ah, oh, okay. Okay, so he's five turns in. Right, we need to. That's our first down. Oh god. Regroup. Right, let's uh, get these leveled up here. Uh, so, what have you just got? Increase health. Yes, Mr. Borman. I feel like you're going to need more health to be like more of a tank. Uh, you're going to be on the front line all the time and uh, close quarters. So, um, she's got one already. Currently, it extends the throw range by three. I think we go with this root, this ability. It can be used as defensive or inoffensive. I wonder when they mutate their actual physical appearance changes. Interesting. Elder Almighty, I've seen some crazy shit in the zone, but this takes the bullet. This house must have belonged to some small people. Whoa. I mean, small, small. Easy. That is just the weirdest. Okay, Borm is just like, ah, I want to climb up just for the fun of it. I need to get him healed in combat, like, as soon as. Maybe at the start of the next game. Next uh, fight. So I was talking to Iridia, and she told me about this ancient machine she had seen out in the zone, not too far from here. She said it looked like it had fallen from the sky, crashed into the ground, and it spread more than enough scrap around for us. I didn't sign up to hunt some ghoul looters. This is ridiculous. They're everywhere. Faster! We got to get this stuff back to the rear before Grey One Two goes dogs as well. Look at these things! We are heroes! Grey One will love us, make us her favorites. Grey One is our leader, not our friend. She sees these goodies, she takes them, kills us. Ah, stick it up your nose hole. Grey One is a weak old hag. Oh, I hope she didn't hear that. Did you hear that? Uh -huh. Alpha level clearance only. Helipad. Back oh, a little I'm sorry, Grey One. That Bingo. A now key. for the fun stuff. <laughs> Oh, a helmet. Where is immune to critical hits? A tough helmet uh, is once protected ancient explorers in the conquest of the unknown. The thick and sturdy construction uh, will protect its wearer against critical hits. Nice. I think we've just got a uh, a helmet for Mr. Borman over here. <laughs> That's great. Is immune to critical hits, which will be uh, which will be vital with him being uh, close quarter combat. Huh, that's funny. Saw a storybook in the Ark about the ancients. They were wearing suits of armor just like this. He's not going to see us. Hello. Yeah, it's getting fun. This guy is a, a high-ranking unit. Oh. 
<gasps> oh my god. Yeah, but now everyone else has heard you because fucking... Whoa, hello. Selma over there missed. That guy, man, look at his health. Level 16, we've got butchers coming out of there. We have a dog. And a second dog. And a pyro. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh my god, can you please hit? So, with them being grouped up like this, he's only on half cover as well. Overwatch. Kill you. Just hit me with a stick. This is the guy we've got to be careful of. Be careful of. The bird! Hit him! Getcha! Jesus. Got it. That fucking stinks. Personal injury, personal injury detected. Care provider on approach vector. Hurts. Stay still. I'm gonna patch you up. You're the best. God, you hit. Yeah! Smashed him. Great work. Got fire. We've got no health kits left. Sorry about that. We are unstoppable. Is there a way we can retreat from this? Overwatch. Care unit in man. Injury analysis in progress. Stung me with that one. I'm it. We need to get out of here. Got a medbot out of range. 
How do we retreat? Still on fire as well, so they're gonna go down to one health in a minute. Oh, we're in a pickle. Bot's gonna revive. I want to retreat from this. Move at a long distance at high speed in Grant's thing. Can we retreat? Foreman. He needs to move, he's in fire. Oh, I'm panicking here, guys. I'm not gonna lie. Because these two are about to drop. Should definitely have not engaged this battle. Let's root them. Okay, he has to reload off before every time. And he just bring this hunter back. Smash the feather one, no sweat on it. Gotcha. And Great. he's quite down. <laughs> this is not good. They've both just gone down. There's no way we can win this. Four turns. Injury detected. 
Triage in I'm progress. bleeding here. Hey, you don't think I can see this? Overwatch. Reinserting intestines into patient's yes. body cavity. Put it back to you. Happy to help. Kill the woman! As good as... You uh -oh. can't beat me! They fought bravely. They fought true. Well... That went horribly... Horribly... Horribly wrong.